there are two aspects uh, one is knowledge how you consume knowledge mm. that gives you marks that gives you certificates uh, because what and that forms a perception uh. the other thing other thing is you know your soft skills the way you behave the way you speak shubham kithi chan bolto दो सॉर्ट ऑफ थिंग्स येस येस शुभम किती छान बोलतो द स्माईल आय हॅव बीन टोल्ड अलॉट अबाउट माय स्माईल आय डोंट नो हाऊ इट इट्स लुकिंग राईट नाव द सॉफ्ट स्किल इज समवेअर इन आर सोसायटी इन आर एज्युकेशनल सिस्टीम नॉट गिव्हन एनी इम्पॉर्टन्स ॲट ऑल लकीली फॉर मी यू वुड हॅव ऑब्झर्व दॅट आय यूज टू बी यु नो होस्टिंग एनी ऑल द प्रोग्राम्स दॅट वेअर हॅपनिंग इन आर स्कूल ऑर इंटर कॉलेज कॉम्पिटिशन इंटर स्कूल कॉम्पिटिशन राईट सो लकीली आय गॉट दॅट चान्स to develop those skills okay but i don't know the education system right now if if it has improved that that would be really great but if it has not then everyone so in school no one pays attention to all these things right but uh, if you are talking to a generation who is in their 20s uh-huh. they are well aware of what's required in the outside world and if they want to be in good books with everyone and if they want everyone to be impressed by them not everyone uh, you shouldn't insist that but a majority of people at least your interviewers uh, uh, if you want them to be impressed by you then you should focus on these things and you should fo- and how how do you learn that you know you don't um, enroll into a course for everything you put yourself in such situations you know you are traveling in a train you talk talk to your uh, you know fellow passengers uh, you are sitting in a workshop you talk to your you know who sitting beside you you force yourself in such situations mm. and that's how you evolve okay. you need content and on that content only you can create knowledge, knowledge. right so first is uh, apart from the uh, educational knowledge i'd see you need a lot of content you need need a lot of information and that's the best part of today's world that there's there's n number of channels ah. from which you can get information Okay so everyone has information but everyone is not knowledgeable everyone is not intellectual so what's the difference mm-hmm. what makes someone a knowledgeable person or an intellectual person it's the way how that person processes that information you must understand something mm-hmm. that knowledge comes after you process the information and that's why everyone's knowledge level or perception level is different right so uh first you have to put yourself in such situations second you have to open up the ways through which content is reaching out to you third you need to you know uh, have your own way of processing that information okay. then only you can uh, you know convert it into a knowledge mm-hmm. and then only people will call you an expert of a particular field okay yeah extraordinary 